everybody. This is Lonnie Nickel. We're here at Scott Trade Center for the first ever WWE pay per view called Extreme Rules at Scott Trade Center. Tonight, every match will be extreme. So uh, we'll go talk to some people and see what they think about tonight and some other questions. Okay, uh, my first question is, who or what are you looking forward to tonight at the Extreme Rules pay per view? I'm looking forward to seeing John Cena kick Ryback's butt. Uh, huge John Cena fan. Do, 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 do. The time is up. The time is now. The champ is here, baby. Who is your favorite WWE superstar and why? Besides Larry Nickel, Seamus. I look like him. I'm actually Lamus. I'm his brother. Lame. Yeah, yeah you lost lo his long lost brother. Lamus. Lamus. <laughs> okay, uh, since this is Extreme Rules, I know you're a lady though, but would you rather get hit in the head with a steel chair or a baseball bat? I think a steel chair. <laughs> I don't know why, but baseball bat, it could be metal or it could be wooden. Who or what are you looking forward to tonight at the Extreme Rules pay review? Randy Orton and Big Show. Randy Orton. That's the one I want to see. That's, uh, that's the one That's the one that's, that, that's been resonating, that seems to like they've got the most hype around it. So I definitely want to see Randy Orton. Uh, and segue, who do you think is going to win the match? Oh, Randy. Hometown. Come on now. Okay. Who? <laughs> uh, I need to some uh, credentials or something, sir. Do country rankings tonight? <laughs> All right, let's do it. Okay. Do you think St. Louis will ever get the grand day of all pair of views WrestleMania? We deserve it, don't we? I hope we get it next year or after the Superdome gets it. We deserve it. Look at this crowd out here. People lined up all day to get in. Yeah, I know. Cody Wills was talking about that on the wake-up call on, on 590 a couple days ago. Okay. Okay. Who is your favorite WWE superstar of all time and why? Stone Cold, because he's a badass. Because he's a person who likes to look like the Macho Man Randy Savage, right? A little bit. I guess if there's a resemblance there, tell all the ladies that's fine with me. Yeah, because it, it, the reason I say that is because of the hair. Yeah, I've been growing it for a little while now. Who or what are you looking forward to tonight at the Extreme Rules pay per view? I brought my son down here to watch Extreme Rules. And he's hoping John Cena wins. What do you think is the most extreme moment in WWE history? Ooh, I'd say uh, Mick Foley going off the top of the cage for Undertaker some years back. How about you, sir? Same question. <laughs> the same answer like him. Okay, uh, do you think St. Louis will ever have WrestleMania? Uh, I, I'm very hopeful, but as long as uh, Kroenke still owns uh, the Ever Jones Dome, I'm not seeing it happen. <laughs> yeah, because the, the Dome still needs to get the upgrades. Yeah. What's your most dream thing you have done in your life? The most dream thing? Extreme. Extreme thing? Uh, I don't know if it's polite to say that on <laughs> Oh, gosh. The most extreme thing I've ever done was dance on a coffee table, I guess you could say. <laughs> Since this is a pair of you called Extreme Wolves, would you two rather get hit over the head with a steel chair or baseball bat? I take steel chair. Yeah, I'm gonna take steel chair. <laughs> Who is your favorite WWE superstar and why? Um, the only, um, Chris Jericho. Cause that's the only one I know. Yeah, cause he was at Bush Stadium today. Stadium and I saw him there. Okay, since this is Extreme Wolf, would you rather get hit in the head with a chair or a baseball bat? I'd rather get hit in the face with Stephanie McMahon wherever she wants to hit me in the face. Can I do that? You better watch it because it hurts. Yeah. What is the most extreme? What is the most extreme thing you have done in your life? The most extreme thing that I've ever done in my life is probably this interview right here, Nixie. Who is your favorite WWE superstar and why? I like John Cena because he's sexy. I gotta say, you got two championship belts. Are you gonna defend them tonight? Against anybody who wants to defend it against me, I dare them. And did you enjoy the game today? Oh, well, I didn't make it. I, I don't know who won. I was just, I come 60 miles south to come up here to watch this, so. Okay. Since this pair of you is called Extreme Wolf, would you rather get hit in the head by a steel chair or a baseball bat? Are you going to do it to me right now? I say a steel chair right now. We ready? I don't have the steel chair. I was just asking the question. You got the bat then? 
I don't have that either. Uh, well. Oh, that's I'll give you. Which one would you take? I would say a uh, fluorescent light tube. I'm gonna I'm gonna take option C, fluorescent light tube. That's a first. Do you think St. Louis will ever get WrestleMania? I sure hope so. I'd give anything. I'd be right here, front and center, as soon as if they did. <laughs> what is the most extreme thing you have done in your life? Um, interviewed with Larry Nickel right here in front of Scott Trade Center before Extreme Rules. Since this is an Extreme Rules point of view, would you rather get hit over the head with a steel chair or a baseball bat? A uh, steel chair for sure, and hopefully it leaves a dent for everybody to remember me by. Who or what are you looking forward to tonight at the WWE Extreme Rules pay review? Uh, Dean Ambrose versus uh, Kofi Kingston. Why do you say that? Because uh, you know there's a hometown boy in this pay review tonight, right? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm Randy Orton. I'm looking forward to that too. What What is the most extreme thing you have done in your entire lifetime? That I can't talk about on TV. Okay. That's understandable. <laughs> or oh, what are you looking forward to tonight at the Extreme Rules pay review? I was really looking forward to Ziggler, but apparently that's not going to happen tonight. So I'm going to have to say I'm looking forward to Team Hell No. Team Hell No defending the titles tonight against the Shield. So You think they're going to win as a segue? Oh, tough to say. Tough to say. It de kind of depends on if they put a stipulation. to hell tonight. Love it. It depends on if they put a stipulation on it. You know, I don't. I think the Shield, I think the numbers game might get them, so we'll see. We'll well, I, think, I think that match has, has a stipulation called a Texas Tornado match. Oh, yes, I forgot. Who or oh, what are you guys looking forward toward tonight at the Extreme Rules pay review? Looking forward to right back upsetting everybody and beating John Cena. How about you, sir? Same question. I want to see the world's strongest man put a beat down on Sheamus. Now, why would, why would somebody want to put a beat down on Sheamus? <laughs> Because I interviewed him when he had, he had, him, had his mat down here in St. Louis. Don't get me wrong, I like Shane, but I just I got to see Mark Henry do it tonight. <laughs> yeah. And great whipping off John Cena, by the way. And the final question is, what is the greatest country in the whole world? Well, according to Larry Nickel and according to me, the well, number one is right here in the United States of America, baby. USA. Woo! My final question is, what country, in your opinion, is the greatest country in the whole entire world? Oh, USA, man. All day. USA all the way. Okay, my final question is, what country do you think is the top in the whole entire world? What country? The United States of America. What do you think is the greatest country in the whole entire world? The United States of America. What is the greatest country in the whole entire world? What is the what country? The greatest country in the whole entire world. The United States. Nothing else. <laughs> what is the greatest country in the whole entire world? USA, no doubt. USA. My final question is, what is the greatest country in the whole entire world? USA. What country, in your opinion, is the greatest one in the whole entire world? Well, of course the United States. And my final question is, what is the greatest country, in your opinion, in the whole entire world? Right here, the USA, baby. What country do you think is the greatest country in the whole entire world? Not even a question. Yes. Jack Swagger's America. Right, right thing, but uh, wrong person. What is the greatest country in the whole entire world? USA. Uh, there, there, that's not even a question. That, that, that's a statement right there. That, that, shouldn't even be a, that shouldn't even be a question. USA. Okay, my final question is, what do you think is the greatest country in the whole entire world? The greatest country, USA, without a doubt. Thank you, sir. I hope you find a challenger for your belt. Hi, this is Lane Nickel again. I've been walking around talking to some of the fans about their favorite extreme moments for other stuff. And I'm about ready to go inside and enjoy the pair of you tonight. This is Lane Nickel signing off from Finite of Man, KFNS, and InsideSDL.com. Good night, everybody.